Ah, thank you for joining me. I'm going to be reading the Earth Class Notes, taken from the writings of the Twelfth Apostle, entitled Mentorship. Many years ago, a young friend of mine came by to visit, asking me about our brief time here on this earth. And he asked, wouldn't it be easier for a believer just to go with the flow in our society? No one notices. No one knows or cares anything about our witness for God. So why should we give it a second thought? Observing this young man's attitude at the time, it was evident he would choose the path of least resistance. Learn through experience. Years passed. And he came back by to share with me the many experiences, saying, I tried taking the easy way and was hit with more spiritual attacks than I ever thought possible. I concluded that if we don't continually apply the truth we've learned and fulfill the purpose of why we're here, this world will run us into the ground. This world will trample us beneath its feet. His conclusion was correct. For if we are not pressing forward in our witness for God, we will get knocked backward. And there is no middle ground. There is no real in-between. The position of mentorship must be learned and earned, as it will remain a part of who we are forever. Realize that everyone who has ever lived, if they so choose to, can currently view what we're doing with our time here. And they can use it as a reference for what they possibly could or should have done when they were here. They're learning so much from observing your life and mine. Our lives here stand as a mentorship to the angels as they too learn from how we live our life. You see, no angel has ever experienced the limitations and challenges of living a life here. Living a life in a very hostile environment. They now observe how we're doing so, especially concerning our emotions, emotions which must continually be controlled in this world that is quickly becoming more and more emotionally based. Our belief is not a hope so, but rather a no so belief, a belief based upon God himself and his son, Jesus. Therefore, when we see this world crumbling around us, we, we can look up because we know our redemption draws near and it is already so close, even at the door. Until